What's up, YouTubers? This is Mr. Mega Man Fan, and it's time for another mail call. I'm going to start with a package from Japan. I've already removed the customs declaration, but other than that, the package is still in the box. And I want to say thank you to all 325 subscribers, I believe, as of the date I'm recording this. Might be more by the time it's released. If it is, thank you very much for that. Appreciate all of you, and if you're not a subscriber, you can always become one just by clicking on that subscriber link. And if you click the bell, you get notifications when I open up new stuff like this. And what is this, you ask? Well, it's a package from Ami Ami, obviously, given the little note they inserted. Thank you for shopping with us, it says. But it's more than that. It's not just a package from Ami Ami. It is something Mega Man related from Ami Ami. Ta da! Not an Edgelord, not Edgy, Edge Style Rockman X. Isn't that just a thing of beauty? Look at all the artwork. Let's get a good look at that artwork all the way around. Bottom on the side, on the back, all in Japanese, which I am unfortunately unable to read, but Rockman, or as he's known, Mega Man in the United States and other territories, well, he's a universal language, and this is one of my favorite versions of him, Mega Man X, from X, X2, and X3, I guess you could argue X4, some of the other games in the X series after that, not so fabulous, but X through X4, all classics as far as I'm concerned, and this is a classic look, complete with the red gem in his helmet. What a thing of beauty. That's not all. We're also going to open a pack of pint-sized heroes from Mega Man before this is all said and done, but I've got another package that I'll open up first before we get to that. Pop the seal on this. And what do we have inside? But man versus snake. Now, Tim let me know that this was going to be discontinued on Netflix as of September 1st, I believe. So I went ahead and ordered the Blu-ray because this movie is good enough that I want to watch it again multiple times. And if you've never seen it before, it's funny, dramatic, hilarious, awesome. And the Blu-ray should have some extra features that I've never seen before in the version that's on Netflix, or was on Netflix, I should say. So, if you like movies like Indie Gamer or King of Kong, I would say Man vs. Snake is right up your alley. If you've never seen it, go out of your way to see it. And if you want to see a Q&A session that they did when it premiered at the Omaha Film Festival, I have two videos up on this channel with Walter Day and Tim McVeigh, among others, talking about the making of the movie and some of the things that went into it. So, Man vs. Snake gets a hearty endorsement from me. So, that's two packages from the mail call that just leaves us with time to open a pint size heroes pack will I get something new or will I get something I've already had before there's only one way to find out inside this pack of pint size heroes we have I've added another Olek man to my collection how about that that's pretty sweet he is one of 12, so not exactly going to call him super rare, but my cat Tingo wants to make a cameo here, appropriate enough since he's named after the robot from Mega Man 5 that assists Mega Man, Mega Man 5 on Game Boy, I should clarify. No, Tingo, there's no kitty treats here for you, and please don't rub your face on that. I would prefer you not. Well, his butt's going to sit there while I put the rest of this stuff away. So, thank you for watching this video. Mr. Mega Man Fan saying so long for now.